Business owners, of course, are responsible for leading their employees and making big decisions, but leaders need mentorship too. That's what Donald Thompson does. He is the author of Leadership Lessons, Time Choices, and he joins me now. It's nice to have you here. Thank you for having me. I'm excited to be here. Yeah, so you've got several tips that leaders can learn, and one of those lessons is understanding how ego can have a detrimental effect on your business. What do you mean by that? A lot of times entrepreneurs are very hard charging. We have great ideas, we have a vision for what we want to do, but sometimes we forget that doing it together as a team is the critical factor to making it. Mm. And a lot of times uh, ego can get in the way of economics because you don't slow down to ask for the help you need to really accelerate the growth of your idea. Oh, right? okay. And so typically we encourage people to say, wait a minute, where are some like-minded people blended with people who have different ideas and perspectives? And are you really willing and able right, to take the guidance that you need with the outcome being most important, not just your idea, but really the individuals put together as a team, right, that can do something fantastic. Mm, that's great advice. Okay, let's talk about teamwork. The best idea wins. <laughs> so in our corporation, uh, one of the things that is very interesting is I don't have a technology background, although I lead technology companies, mm. right? So it's been very important for me to humble myself, really find people that have the technology underpinning that we need and knit those ideas together. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times doing that means you're gonna have to have some healthy tension. You're gonna have to have some meetings where there's a little bit of conflict, mm -hmm. but you coalesce that conflict into the right thing to the consumer, mm -hmm. and then all of a sudden you give yourself the best chance to win. Okay, and how about choices, time choices? How does a leader get that right? The time choices, I think, are absolutely critical, right? You wouldn't let uh, somebody steal money out of your pocketbook right. or steal money out of your wallet. But what you would do is be very protective of those things that are precious. A lot of times people spend more time protecting their money than they do their time, mm. right? And whether it is that interrupt on the telephone, whether that's that email that you don't really need to respond to today, or whether that's that TV show that you should watch later mm -hmm. while you're finishing up your critical priorities, how you spend your time, effort, and energy is really the critical tool that everybody has access to to really make it in today's environment. Okay, all this sounds great. I'm, I'm taking it in, sure. but how do you get a leader to actually do it? So one of the things is you have to have a goal big enough that you're willing to change your personal habits to win. So small goals will not elicit change in people. But if you have something that is so unique, so special to yourself personally, mm -hmm. whether it's wanting to have the money to put a kid through college and pay cash for college, that will give you the time choices to stay out of maybe the high price coffee shop and be more economical. Maybe you don't need that new car right now. Maybe you're looking for a promotion and instead of whining about the amount of work you have, you seek more and extra and it focuses you on the big goal and gives you the ability to really change. Mm, the is, goal is really the key. Okay, does this take time with leaders that you've worked with? At it, it takes two things, right? It takes both time and it takes mentorship. Nobody is gonna make tremendous change on their own. That uh, vision mm -hmm. of that solo success person mm -hmm. uh, is really not real. Mm -hmm. uh, I've been very fortunate in my career to have people that trusted me and cared enough about my career to give me the truth as they saw it, and then I as an individual business person could determine to take it or not. Mm. But you have to seek out that advice if you really want to be successful. Great advice. Thank you so much, and thanks for coming in to tell us about it. You're very welcome. Thanks for having me. Mm -hmm.